Good morning, Shelly. It's all about helping local businesses get back on their feet. This morning, I'm joined by Melissa Lizaway. How are you? Good morning. Very well. Thank you. No problem. Now, tell us a little bit about Great Harvest and how the pandemic has really impacted you all. Well, we're a locally owned um, bakery, cafe. Um, the pandemic has definitely um, affected us mostly in our restaurant or a cafe area. Um, it's been definitely a challenge. Um, a lot of people have started working from home, so um, they're not out having their lunches yes. with us. Yeah, so um, I know you guys are working to give back to things. You're adding new things to your menu. We have a delicious salad in front of us. Yeah, we actually brought our salads back just this last week, um, so we're super excited about that. Um, of course, we've always had our paninis and mm -hmm. um, our regular sandwiches, um, but we're so excited to bring back the salads. Yes, and how has community support been for you all throughout this? Community support is amazing. Um, Nina is such a great community. Um, everybody comes out in droves to try to um, support their local businesses. Yes, it's so important. And this morning we also have Nikki with us. Nikki is also from Future Nina. Nikki, now this has been a time for you. You guys have had to get really creative. So how has Don, how's Dine Out Week helping restaurants? Yes, um, our friends at Fox Communities Credit Union are helping us support local restaurants uh, this week and next week. So through April 25th, next Friday, every $25 you spend in Nina community-wide dining out. So that includes pickup, delivery, curbside, dine-in, all of it. You can submit your receipts to us at Future Nina or at Nina.org, and every $25 you spend gets you one entry into a drawing for 10 prize packages of $100 worth of Nina restaurant gift certificates. Yes, and why is that so important? I know that a lot of restaurants have had to be at capacity and had different things going on. So how has it been for you just having to find ways to help those local businesses out to keep them in town? Yeah, it's been challenging, but also a really sort of a time for us to think outside of the box, and we've really uh, refocused a lot of our events and promotions and efforts toward seeing how we can support local businesses as much as possible. Yes, and you all are both doing a great job. Melissa smells good in here. Nikki, you are amazing. <laughs> Thanks. <laughs> Thank yeah. you all for joining us. We are live in downtown Nina right now. If you just come down the strip, you can get so many good eats. Shelly, I got to bring you something back. <laughs> Make it something good. It looks like everything is good there that you've been showing so far. Thanks, Faith.